my name is TJ and today I'm gonna show you how to create your own custom weapon skins for Blood Trail VR. That's right, we're gonna make our own mods today. So if you want a gold Glock or, I don't know, something completely unique to you, I've got you covered. You're gonna need three programs though. First one is called U-Model. I'll put the link in the description for that. Just go download that. Second of all, Unreal Engine 4.27. Unreal Engine is a free engine that you can use. It's on the Epic Games launcher. So if you're familiar with that, download and install Unreal Engine 4.27. The third program you need is basically any photo editor that lets you use layers. Personally, I use paint.net because it's free and it has an abysmal amount of plugins and stuff that you can use and it's all free. So that's why I use this. Those are the three programs you need. So let's get started. First of all, I'm going to open U-Model. I have it installed. Open the EXE and here we go. UE Viewer Startup Options. What you're gonna do is click the three circles here, the three dots, and then go to wherever you have Blood Trail installed. For me, it's on the C drive, BTVR, content, and then you click packs. There's nothing in here, but just select the folder and click OK. Go into the game folder, scroll down to materials right here, click on the textures right here, and then it says weapons, pistol, reticule. This is the Beretta, and if you want the Glock, it's right here. Then we're gonna click on base color and click export. Now you're gonna export this to wherever you want. I have made a new folder right here on the desktop called BT Mod. Let's say we're gonna put it in there. All right, fine with Unreal Engine 4.27. Okay. Now let's go look in that folder right here. Open that up. It says Game, Materials, Textures, Glock. And there we go, there's your Glock texture. Now once we have this Glock texture, we can open it up with paint.net and then we can edit it. So let's say, I don't know, maybe you wanna write your name down on the left side of the magwell, or on the magazine itself, or like right here, this is the rear sight. Maybe we wanna make that red. And this right here is the front sight, I believe. Let's make that red as well. So there's our edited skin. Now we're gonna Save this as a TGA file with the same name and everything. Click save, replace, yes. There we go. So if I close this now and go to the BT mod folder, game, materials, textures, Glock, there it is with the red accents. From there on, you want to open up Unreal Engine, so let's start the Epic Games. This might take a while the first time you try this, that's normal. But it should launch eventually. There we go. Alright, so it's opened up now. Select New Project and select Game. And click open project. I've already done it. Call it BTVR and 
open that up. So here we have Unreal. Basically, we don't need any of this, but just leave it as is. Now open that folder that you made on the desktop, the BT mod folder. Game, materials, textures, Glock. Take this image, slide it on down here to Unreal, and put it in the bottom thing here. As you can see, I already have a couple things. So it imports the image, and now what you need to do is right click, save the image, drag the image on over to anything in here, just anything, doesn't matter, just pick the table or whatever. Alright, that's good. And then top left, click file, and then down here it says cook content for Windows. Click that, bottom right, it's gonna load for a little bit. When it's done, go to your documents. Right here it says Unreal Projects, BTVR, click Saved, Booked, Windows No Editor, BTVR, Content, and you'll have a UEXP, a UBulk, and U asset file. You need the U asset, U bulk, and U exp. Select the three of them, right click them, cut them out. Then you can close this, close that, go to your folder that you made on the desktop, open that up. Go to Game, Materials, Textures, Glock, delete whatever is in here, and paste the new files over. Then, you just treat this like it's any other mod, so you don't take the game folder, but you take the materials, right click, cut that, go to wherever you have Blood Trail installed, uh, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Blood Trail. If you've modded the game before, you know where to put these in the content folder, right? So you won't have these two. It'll be movies and packs if you don't have any mods yet. But we're gonna copy our created mod in here. There we go. And that's it. It should work from there. Let me put on the headset and see if it works. Alright, we're in full screen. That's good. Flip. Let's grab the Glock. Oh, would you look at that? Red iron sights. Nice. It works. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys have a lot of fun making your own mods. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.